YouTube. Brandon Relkam here today with a new YouTube video. In this video I'm going to be doing a part one to the uh, CD collection for February 2021. Uh, I'm going to be separating this into two parts. The reason why is because I've got a CD coming in the mail at the beginning of the upcoming week and it just makes more sense to me to separate the CDs that I have planned for this month um, into uh, two parts just because for me to do an entire video on the CDs I have now and then having the wait I don't know how many more months to get a sufficient amount of CDs just to include the CD that's coming in the mail next week it, it just does not seem logical to me either way before I, I get into it don't forget to subscribe don't forget to leave a like and of course don't forget to turn on post notifications so you will not miss any videos when I upload them with that being said let's get right into it so starting off we have Megadeth hidden treasures I was pretty surprised to find this at my uh, local CD store because um, I don't know how rare or common this album is to find on CD but either way this album has some good stuff on it it's got a cover of Alice Cooper's No More Mr. Nice Guy, um, Paranoid, originally done by Megadeth. It has 99 Ways to Die on it, easily one of my favorite Megadeth songs. And uh, yeah, there's some really cool stuff on this. If you ever find it in a CD store online or whatever, I definitely suggest buying this compilation album. Up next we have the best of Judas Priest living after midnight and uh, you know it's a typical greatest hits album with you know some of the band's most popular and best songs also has some live tracks on it there was another compilation Judas Priest album at the CD store when I got this but it had less tracks on it so of course, I wanted to get something that had more tracks on it. It has um, 17 on it. And it's also got some bonus tracks on it, so that's cool. But yeah, all kinds of stuff from all kinds of good albums. I got some British Steel, Ram It Down, Screaming for Vengeance. So yeah. And just like the Megadeth compilation album, I've got this has cool stuff on it. Next we have Mastodon, Blood Mountain. I haven't really gotten into Mastodon too much. I've listened to, um, what was it, Leviathan? I think that's what the album's called. And um, I enjoyed the album, so I figured I'd get a, another Mastodon album to check it out. I've read good reviews about this, so I have no doubt this is going to be good. So yeah, Mastodon. Up next we have a classic album. We've got Ozzy Osbourne, Blizzard of Oz. Debut album from Ozzy's side solo project, whatever you want to call that. But uh, yeah, this is a expanded edition, so this has stuff that uh, didn't make its uh, that not that it didn't make its way, but it wasn't on the original CD. It's got that uh, minute-long guitar solo of Randy Rhodes playing, and uh, you know, how could you not like this album if you don't like it? Just a classic heavy metal album. How could you not like Randy Rhodes if you don't like him? Amazing guitarist. It's such a shame that he had died so young. He probably would have left Ozzy if he hadn't died, but either way, super amazing guitar player. It's, it's a shame that he was not able to reach his full potential and didn't get a chance to play on any other material. Last but not least, we have Black Label Society, Grimmiest Hits. Uh, Black Label's newest album from 2017 if my memory serves me right. But uh, yeah, 
This one I actually got at a uh, CD store in a mall in my town rather than the local CD store I always go to. And uh, as you can see, I haven't taken the plastic covering off of it. Just because, you know, I'm lazy. But, uh, we have some cool stuff on here. Let's see, Room of Nightmare, that's a good song. Uh, I love Unreal, Disbelief, Illusions of Peace. But yeah, good stuff on here. Absolutely love Black Label Society and Zach Wilde. And, uh, I don't know, hopefully we get a new Black Label Society album within uh, the next year or so. So yeah, that pretty much wraps it up for this CD video. I hope you liked it. If you did, leave a like on it. Don't forget to subscribe. And stay tuned for the part two of the CD collection for February 2021.